Happy Sunday at Dante's Kitchen. Today we'll be making Tinkin Toe. See the hard shell and we have it um, cut. But you have to use something hard. You have to put it on a hard surface and use like a um, hammer. I use a cutlass. The back of the cutlass to do it, but you can use the hammer to do it. So the hard, then I open it. Here I have it here. And the scientific name is Harmonia Corioborel. It's a seed right there. Um, what I do is I put it in water, like a cup of water, and leave it to soak. So you soak off the flesh and you'll get the seed. So here I had it pre-soaked. So I'll, I'll, get, I'll take out the seed from it. Because actually I'm going to blend it. So I have to take, take the, um, the seed away from it. So I only need the flesh really. Like the, the meat part of it. The hard part. You look at it. Look at it. So you break it. You can actually eat it. And you can actually use it and make a punch. Right? And this is like the flesh part of it. So I'm actually taking away the seeds. Then I'll, I'll add... Um, Stout. I'll add stout to it. So I'll add um, a cup of stout and I'll, I'll use condensed milk to sweeten and I'm going to add a little cinnamon for taste. I'll be using, uh, uh, when I blend it, I'll blend it um, over ice so you can have that smooth chili taste. I'm trying to get rid of all, all the, um, the seeds because I don't want the seeds to blend. So I'm ensuring that all the seeds are out of it. And the health, the health benefit of thinking to, as we call it in the Caribbean, or the scientific name, Amania Coriborel, it has um, health properties or it has health benefits. So it's good for asthma, it's good for laryngitis, it's good for athlete's toe or athlete's foot. It's good for laryngitis, it is good for diarrhea or constipation. And you realize there's a paste to it. Look at it, what thick it is. So after removing the seeds, I'm actually going to add uh, the stout. So I'm adding the stout to it. Then I'm going to add I'm actually adding some condensed milk. I'm going to add about two tablespoons. See, two tablespoons. So we don't want it. It actually have a little sweet taste to it. So we actually don't want too much of the sugar in it. I pour some ice in, and now I'm going to cover it. I'm using a bullet to blend. So I'll be blending. So here is the finished product. There you go, nice and smooth and have a caramel look, right? And I know you'll enjoy this on your Sunday evening. So look at the look at the consistency of it. It's lovely. Alright, um, thank you for watching and enjoy.